hello and namaste friends friends today i'll show you how to make uh, a backdrop okay in an easy manner and uh, very gaudy one i'll show you you can use it you can just again fold it you can keep it back you can reuse it again and again for special occasions like pujas kirtans um, small gatherings okay so for that we need a uh, few kinds of laces okay this is the lace this is this is very inexpensive this is around 8 rupees per meter and i need some uh, uh, like these are the booties these are the ready made booties uh, and this one i've taken out from uh, uh, one of my old dress okay and these are like uh, these are some dangles and see friends uh, this is also uh, uh, i've used it from an old bandarwal okay i've taken out all the latkans and dangles i just Uh, took it out and I'm using it as a lace. Okay, so we need this fabric. This is around uh, two meters of fabric. Okay, and uh, now what we do? I'll show you. Now see friends, take the right side. Okay, this is the uh, right side, and you just fold this this fabric like this equally. You fold it like this, and what we are going to do now? you from the center you hold it from like this and from the end you hold it like this and you have to like fold this like this okay from here also you have to do the hold from here and corner inside like this this should be pointed together okay now we are going to stitch this friends you can do it with hands you can do it in the machine okay we will stitch this and you also seal the borders like you have the raw edges please seal it like i have the raw edges over here the i'll seal this inside okay after that now see friends we will stitch it like this you don't have to stitch this part with this i mean this one only okay you stitch it like this from inside also you have to stitch it so that it doesn't open you get a triangle over here okay now what do you have to do friends take this lace i have taken this lace you take any matching lace okay and we have to after this gets stitched we will take this and we will stitch it along the corners like from upper corner till the end then again you turn it and you stitch it you stitch it like this okay leaving little space we will stitch it till the end same way we will repeat with the the outer corner also friends this corner also we will do the lacing we will stick stitch the lace along all the four corners uh, along the length and breadth okay and see this lace i have got this also i will stitch it along the end okay and after that we are going to see how to place the booties and other things and we will do little bit of coloring also here and there little bit of uh, uh, maybe some uh, motifs we will draw and some bead work also so see friends i have attached i've stitched that lace all along the four corners can you see all along the four corners i have attached that uh, red lace towards the end okay towards the end i have attached uh, stitched that red lace and i have also stitched those booties or motifs which was of fabric with a lot of uh, uh, sequence work and stone work i have also uh, stitched that 
okay and towards the center let's see what we will do we can uh, paint or we can do some thread work or something which easy we can attach some other motive of some god or anything which we like okay and this is the triangle i've shown you how to fold it okay so this is that uh, another motive which is of stone i have also stitched this along this triangle base and i have attached this one of the dangles okay and friends this was the triangle this was the fold where the triangle was this is the line along this line also we need to put something i will attach this plain lace just gota lace or some other lace you can also put okay since uh, we are using it for some cultural functions i am uh, using lot of gotas see this is the patti gota patti this is called the gota patti you can lay, uh, use any other lace too okay i had this and it was uh, matching well so i used this friends okay maybe i I'll, i'll be using some more dangles okay and uh, some uh, like these are the sequins i can stitch this also in between so till this like we have to do this uh, uh, see, uh, now i will stitch this gota along this triangle ends okay both the ends of these triangles along this end from here till that end i will attach this gota i will stitch it with hand or machine you can do it okay see friends you have to take two any of the metal bangles old bangles you had okay metal bangles or any kind of uh, uh, small or big rings and i will apply a coat of fevicol on this okay a coat of fevicol uh, on this and i will wrap this gota along around this okay so that this looks little gaudy this looks uh, golden beautiful and we will attach this towards the two corners of this backdrop so that we can hang it in some nail or some uh, hook okay so let let's do this now i'll apply this with the fingers or a brush you can use little by little you do it okay take the gota patti see which is the right side and hold it tight from here and keep wrapping tightly like this friends okay here you have to apply a lot of fevicol and keep it like this hold it for some time and i'll finish off like this See like this, friends. This is the end. Apply little more fevicol and hold it tightly for a minute, friends, so that it sticks. Put some more fevicol. hold it tight and then after that we will cut from here see hold it tight from here this is the end and cut the extra and again seal this with some fevicol like this see hold it like this and keep it away for drying same way we will repeat this see friends
now see friends this is a stencil of ganesha this is uh, Oh, this uh, this comes for rupees thirty. Three stencils of different kinds, dif different motifs we get. So I've used this in many ways in my in my earlier videos also. So this is a Ganesha stencil, friends. I will just uh, do the coloring, little bit of coloring, uh, oh, with this stencil. Okay. Uh, see, I will put this stencil. Put uh, put a newspaper beneath this fabric. Okay. And use any color. Uh, I'll be using this uh, fabric color. It is a nice one. It's washable. It won't go off. It's very nice, uh, pantonic one. Uh, there are six shades. Whatever shade you like, you can use it. See, these shades are there. You can also use the metallic shades are also available. So I think I'll be using red. Okay. So let's do this. Spread the newspaper beneath the colors you are using, friends. It may fall off accidentally. So, I am putting this uh, rough. I had this uh, rag. Okay. So, take some color. You don't have to mix any water. Little by little. Don't take too much. Otherwise, it will bleed from the sides. And it will spoil the shape of the uh, figure. The motif. Hold it tightly. You can also stick a, a tape around it. From one side you do it. You can use metallic shades also like gold, bronze or... Uh, Orangish kind of fluorescent colors, also neon colors. See friends, it's done. Hold it properly. Hold uh, the fabric from one with one hand and hold this, and you have to take it off and let it dry. Okay. See, such a beautiful Ganesha. See, let it dry, and it is uh, a permanent color. Friends, don't you worry. You can always wash it. The color won't go off. I'm. I've been using a T-shirt painted with this color. Okay, so no worries. So let it dry then we will move towards the next step which is the last one. Now see friends take the bangles and I have taken this needle with a matching thread and you attach this over here. Uh, little away from the corner not right here I am not putting right here I am putting little here okay from the back little here.
so see friends this is done same way i'll do one over there at the other corner and see friends i am uh, stitching this gota this lace along this line you can use a machine or even uh, you can uh, stitch with your with your hands i'm doing the running stitch over here first i will do it on this side then again this side See friends this is the final look of this backdrop this is very simple yet so pretty see we have uh, stitched these uh, gotas which is very inexpensive each gota you get uh, for around 20 rupees you get a reel so you take one reel and you can get this entire look it's very simple and see this is the ganesha motif we have done the coloring by ourselves this was the motif lakhtkan okay this is towards the end this is how it looks simple but so pretty see friends see and this is a loop i have kept see friends towards the end corner if there is a nail we can just hook it uh, on it and see this was the bangle okay so see friends keep watching give a thumbs up if you like it thank you so much bye bye ta ta